This is Speech Synthesis for WebGL, and I'll show you how to get it working for the Unity Editor. So first I'll switch over to the proxy management scene and hit play. Here's where I'll launch the proxy. This brings up the UAC control. Say yes, and that launched the proxy. Okay. And I'll open a browser tab. Okay. And that uses the Unity API to talk to the proxy and launch a browser tab. You just leave this open. This will proxy the speech API and Unity. And now we're done with proxy management. All right, if I switch to the proxy scene, and hit play. This will connect to the proxy. Text to speech is great. Thumbs up. Okay, so we have a voice selector. Hello, text to speech is great. Thumbs up. Okay, so we can set a slow rate. Hello, text to speech is great. Okay, and Thumbs we can switch to the up. fastest speed. Hello, text to speech is great. Thumbs up. Okay, that's pretty fast. Hello, text to speech is great. Thumbs up. You can also adjust the pitch. Hello, text to speech is great. Thumbs up. Hello, text to speech is great. Thumbs up. Okay. Hello, text to speech is great. Thumbs up. You can also switch to the native voice. Hello, text to speech is great. Thumbs up. You can change the input field to say something else. So, welcome to the demo. All work and no play makes. Jack, a dull boy, right? Welcome to the demo. All work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. Welcome to the demo. All work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. Welcome to the demo. All work and no play makes. Welcome to the demo. All work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. Okay, so you can change the text that it speaks. Uh, if you speak. You can demo. stop in the middle of speech, and there you go. Okay, so using the proxy, we can do speech synthesis. It's running right in the Unity editor. It can also work for Windows standalone. I can go back to proxy management and run this. Okay, and here, browser tab over here, switch back to Unity. Uh, using the API, I can close the browser tab through Unity. That talks to the proxy, and the proxy will close the browser. And also, if I bring the proxy down here, I can close the proxy right from Unity. Okay, well, you can see using the speech proxy, we can proxy the speech API from the browser into Unity. You can use different voices. You can use the different voices to do text to speech. All right, and thanks for watching.